Good, clean, sharp left hand. Now the right hand comes up. Of course, uh, with Lara, uh, his hands. Yeah. yeah I think it's going to be an entertainment. And, and throws power punches like he does right there. Yeah. And when he throws that left hook to the body, he's got to come up. Quantum leap. And he can't finish the job. The round O'Sullivan has had in the fight, even though Lara is still doing a very, for him, for getting up. I Just a, a nine perfect five. Yeah. Perfect. can get. And, and there was a point, that was the left hook, where he, he was knocked down right at the end of the round. This punch hurt him. Now this is Lara's second fight at middleweight. He's giving away to Lara. You see a huge reach disadvantage. With the co-main event of the evening, 12 rounds of boxing, with a record of 31 wins, four losses. Introducing Gary O'Sullivan. <laughs> fighting out of Miami, Florida, by way of Guantanamo, Cuba, tonight in his 12th world title appearance. Introducing Edis Lundy, Lara! Good luck to both of us. So here we go, first round of the... Oh, he hasn't fought a lefty, O'Sullivan, since 2013. Hey, I'm only, I'm only the messenger. <laughs> Center right now, he's not moving like he usually moves. Yeah. Round. Yeah, but even then, he's still really... Uh, ...any matchup, and there's O'Sullivan landing the hook. If you're going... Mm, it's a great counter for the fighter. To give yourself a chance, you've mm -hmm. got to get of in position course. to throw that punch. With Rolly Romero making some noise with his prediction, Spike O'Sullivan said... Of course, uh, with Lara, uh, there it is. Lara's just said that they, he wants Lara at this older age to... Very effective punches. You know, he's, he may not be as quick on his feet. And they all did it with left hooks, and Brian Castagna was able to land that punch. Type of punch, you know, not constantly, but with, against yeah. those fighters. Head to head with O'Sullivan. Good shot to the body. I'm going to be the first man to knock out Eris Landi Laura. We'll see. Punches, and he certainly did that in his last fight where he knocked out Thomas Lamana. His hands. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's going to be an entertainer taking up those hooks, so he, he knows exactly what he's got to try to do. Sits down and, and, and throws power punches like he does right there. Yeah. Down three times in his career, twice by Alfredo Angulo. Laura really crafty, just knows it all in there. Yeah. Use some movement in this fight. O'Sullivan's had trouble with lateral movement. Keep your head down. He sometimes keeps his head way up and he can be hit. So we'll see how that plays out now as we well. He, you know, he can stand there and battle with the best of them. Yeah. And so O'Sullivan not doing a lot here. Especially when he throw punches like O'Sullivan is doing right now and missing. There seconds ago. I would like to see an uppercut. Right after that, his punch numbers go down. Against the lesser fighters, he's very busy. Again, quantum leap, and he can't finish the job. And in these fights where he's in pitch battles, he does well. You are O'Sullivan. You want to keep him busy as much as you yes. can. And even though you sense he doesn't want to be in the corner. Straight left hand from Laura. That's been he busy. Yes. And you know, uh, he stopped him in the fourth round, so he's gotten some quality wins. As much, and he sits down on his punches, and, and like you said, he does really well. The first. Now Sullivan content to work the body there for him. Ah! It was very, very gracious. Yes, Fair indeed. Also. Yeah. More aggression from a Sullivan, but I just, I see him a little too slow. And when he throws that left hook to the body, he's got to come up. For instance, of course, we just saw in a great fight against uh, Jamel. You want to let your punches go if you're a Sullivan, but again. And Sullivan, not really. And nice. you see why, and tonight he's landing 49%. Pushing those punches from O'Sullivan. You know, O'Sullivan can land the left to the body of the round O'Sullivan has had in the fight, even though Lara is still doing a very... O'Sullivan also taking a step back, taking a deep breath as well. Uh, that is not going to get the job done for him. Those punches a little bit. O'Sullivan. Oh. The left hand. Animal. He's a top 154 pounder who's able to get on the inside. Maybe he's not letting his hands go as much. Three tenth among all the fighters that uh, show stats track uh, uppercut from way back. 
since he's not coming up with anything. There it is. I mean, if you don't come up yeah. with... And now pushing O'Sullivan back. And once that starts happening in this fight... All right now is Connery to the body, and he's getting the better Keep of him it. Up. I, th I think it's a little bit too... He's worried about that counter-punching bar. And, you know, Lara... Combination a moment ago. Oh, that's that's a good right hand mm. started it. Mm. Win him rounds if he can't land a lot of them. Danny Garcia, of course, from guard of the Indiana Patriots. One thing that I'm really impressed from this fight right now is... I'm gonna... <laughs> oh, man. Good left hand. Who's been with him for all these years. Good left hand right there. Uh, me too. <laughs> <laughs> Lara is doing just that. I'm older. I can't box. I can't use the whole ring. Castano and the loss to Hurd in great oh. fights. Oh, oh. oh there's there. Oh, Sullivan's face this is all marked up, but his his mustache is again from Lara. Lara starting to bust up. O'Sullivan a little bit. But you know, he he taught them in the in those sparring sessions. Inside. Yeah, we saw the change in the Jared Hurd fight. Well, O'Sullivan is trying, but with yes. very little success. <laughs> oh, my God. You know what? That, <laughs> Abner, you for many uh, years sparring against the Jamel and Jamal's power punches, the not Jamal. Oh, oh, my. There, and he drops. Step over here. And watch you now. And all of O'Sullivan's punches are being caught on the arms. Uh, and other than that, has been successful. Okay. Now, was a Coming into this fight, that was going to be his big power punch in this, and he landed. Oh, let's see if Lara tries to... Well, he's fought nine oh. current or former world champions, Lara. And... Where, well, again, you know, it's, it's the fighter. It's Lara who's making this fight easy. Oh. Oh. Right hand left behind. Not taking a step back, even oh, though he's eating these amazing. punches. Absolutely. Just laying in on the ropes now. It's all that's really not doing much. Mm. Left hand again. Hoping his man can squeeze out some more rounds here. <laughs> it's a, a, a fight is a flowing river to him. <laughs> the idea that O'Sullivan's power has not bothered him in this fight. The best. I think that straight left hand again got O'Sullivan's attention. 52, so. Oh. <laughs> Another good sharp left hand. Lara still being very patient. And that's what I'm talking about, protecting your craft from Lara. He's really just... Patience are just not getting yeah. through. There's a left hand, drives O'Sullivan in. Fights, he would hurt someone, and he, he's not the aggressive one. Yeah. But really, in, in this type of fight, you kind of... Say Two record, but that could be easily be different. He could have a few more wins in that. Lara, even when he gets in trouble, he's still going to wait and counterpunch. Good, clean, sharp left hand. Now the right hand comes up. And O'Sullivan fights off the ropes. Lara had some big moments. Landing this right hook, taking big shots, uh, and throwing in return. Yeah. Best. Yeah, now that last left hook to O'Sullivan. One of the other thing is he's safe when he's literally right on the... the That's more. And we're probably going to see more uppercuts from Lara at the... Yeah. Round your chest. Yeah. Ooh. A little short with that right hand. And throwing more punches than Lara. Straight left hand again from Lara. And then bring it to the head. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it, the... the uh, threw Lara back into the ropes that time. Now Lara with a right... Stop for a moment, but I don't think it hurt him. But it, it really get him. Right on cue. Uh, uh. <laughs> now left. Smart Lara now taking that step back. Yeah. Body shot. Nice yeah. little uppercut. Yeah, did. Oh my, another one. Yeah, even when he oh, would come forward, he could just completely end this fight, and yet... Either, you know, it, it, these punches woke up with Sullivan, or... Ah! Ooh, combination. So Sullivan's trying to uppercut as well, and hasn't been able to get that... This but the big left hand. Fighters have been able to do that against him. O'Sullivan trying, but... He... Now, O'Sullivan landed some nice uppercuts and body work. I'll push. Because O'Sullivan was able to get some shots in in that last round, although it certainly didn't affect him at the beginning of this fight. O'Sullivan had seven weeks to train for this fight. That's when they found. Uh, they, I think I know how you're seeing this fight, but lay it on us. 950. 
All right, thanks very much, Steve. Which he did not get, which was very close against Canelo Alvarez. Well, Larry is 6'3". Doing much of that uh, anymore, no. which is the counter punch, and which was keeping O'Sullivan a little bit tired. I, I, you know, of course, one punch could change that. Seven weeks, you think that's good? I think that's the hits. <laughs> He was a nightmare for judges to score because of all the movement. I used to watch him. I would yeah. think if only he would sit a little bit more on this. Just on a little more, might well have won that decision. And it's one in 12 rounders. Spike O'Sullivan is one in one in 12 rounders. Are not backing himself against the ropes now. Does that mean he's going to stand and showing up here? I, I was going to say that, Barry. You know, it, he. There's a oh. good left hand that hurt him. Close round. This changed it again, the straight left hand of the straight left. I mean, Lara has a really good straight left. And yeah, who's winning? Said, who's winning? It's not I agree. Oh, is that so? ah! Back, so a yeah, game effort by Spike His body lamp, but uh, clearly he was, uh, he was hurt. Michael Sullivan uh, leaves this arena. This may be his last, we pointed out, had not really gotten past the other left hand. Stood. He would have only taken a lot of punishment that would came forward and said, OK, it's time for me to try to end this fight. But anyway, uh, very doubtful he could have come back. And new look for him continues to be a Lara did what he needed to do. And O'Sullivan, as we said, was absolutely landing 54 percent of his power punch is higher than even his normal. I'm a smart bo boxer, a slick boxer. That's what I did tonight. Your vantage point. Everybody always looks forward. What are you looking forward to? What's next? Congratulations. 39 years of age, terrific performance. Thank you.